Hey, it's Richard with Presonus, and you're watching video two of our in-depth look at configuring a larger earmix system. We're going to name all six earmix 16Ms and then send two eight-channel AVB streams to each unit. I'll do this from the console touchscreen and also through universal control. Here's how it looks. From the home menu on the touchscreen, hit audio routing, then hit earmix setup. On the next screen, you'll see a list of connected devices. To identify each device, touch one of the names on the left side of the screen and then touch the interrogate button at the extreme right of the screen. That unit's channel select buttons will flash so that you can identify it. Hit the interrogate button again and the earmix unit will stop flashing. To name the unit, touch the name area on the right side of the screen just to the left of the interrogate button. You can then clear the original name and give it a new one. When done, hit Enter. Repeat these steps for the rest of the units. I'll do the rest except for the three guitar units, and we'll do those in UC. To do this in Universal Control, go to the Settings page, ensure that you have full front of house permission, and then click on the Network tab. The list of earmix units will show up at the bottom left portion of the screen. Select the one you want to work with, interrogate, and then rename by clicking in the name box. Repeat for the remaining units. Now that we have all of our earmix units identified and named, it's time to start routing audio streams. The way our system works is that we have eight streams of eight channel AVB audio. Each earmix unit will get two streams and we can mix and match them for any of the units on the network. All in all, you can have a total of 24 completely different mix combinations. In our scenario, we'll have four different combinations and then we'll duplicate the last one twice so that all three of our guitar players have the same 16 channels sent to their individual units. We'll work in this order and with these stream combinations. Drums will have streams one and two, which are AVB channels one through eight and nine through 16. Bass will have streams three and four, which are AVB channels 17 through 24 and 25 through 32, Keyboard will have streams 5 and 6, which are AVB channels 33 through 40 and 41 through 48. Our three guitarists will share streams 7 and 8, which are AVB channels 49 through 56 and 57 through 64. Now we're ready to start sending AVB streams to each individual unit. I'll send the drums, bass, and keyboard streams via the touch screen, and then we'll see how it looks in UC as I send the last two streams to each of the three guitar players' earmix units. From the earmix setup screen, choose the drums unit. Click the 1 through 8 input source dropdown and select AVB send 1 through 8. Click the 9 through 16 source dropdown and select AVB 9 through 16. Then hit apply. Now, choose the bass earmix unit. Click the 1 through 8 input source dropdown and select AVB send 17 through 24. Click the 9 through 16 source dropdown and select AVB send 25 through 32 and hit apply. Moving on to the keyboard unit, select it and click the 1 through 8 input source dropdown and select AVB send 33 through 40. Click the 9 through 16 source dropdown and select AVB Send 41 through 48, then Apply. Now let's do the two electric and one acoustic guitar units from UC. In the Earmix Setup window at the bottom portion of the network screen, click the Electric Guitar 1 unit. Click the 1 through 8 input source dropdown and select AVB Send 49 through 56. Click the 9 through 16 source dropdown and select AVB Send 57 through 64. Then hit Apply. Repeat those two steps for Electric Guitar 2 and Acoustic Guitar. Now, all three guitar earmix units will receive the exact same 16 channels. At this point, all of our units are assigned their respective AVB streams. So in the next video, I'm going to show you how to set up the mixer's aux sense to accommodate for some submixing. And as you'll see, doing this really unlocks the power of the Studio Live Series 3 ecosystem.